I'm at the age where I'm supposed to have things together. Like this morning, for example, I woke up and I decided I was going to make breakfast. And then I just changed my mind and decided I was going to have leftovers instead. Put that in a microwave, I reheated it like the generation that we are. And I still didn't feel like having any. I just sat around trying to start this vlog trying to be productive and i just couldn't the good thing about having kids young is they grow with you so my daughter figured out i was having trouble starting my vlog and she did it instead my second attempt at starting my day i decided to take down my braids these are the same braids that just three days ago i spent so much time and effort to do but to be honest they didn't come out the way that i wanted and i just didn't like them anymore the only difference with taking my braids down this time was I actually decided to cut my hair off so to be honest ever since I bleached my hair I have just wanted to cut my hair off because whenever I bleach my hair it's just always damaged and I've gone back and forth asking people should I cut my hair making my mind up to cut it and then changing it at the last minute but today I just I just took the scissors and I just went in and at first I was scared and I didn't want to actually cut my hair so at first I was just cutting the braids and then I cut my hair to be honest it's the most rewarding scary feeling i have ever felt in a long while i was so scared because i have never cut my hair this short before and even though i was scared it was like i could not stop myself i just kept going because i know for a fact that this is something that i have wanted to do for so long after the first few cuts, I just felt free. I felt as if I was letting go of something that I held too close for too long and it felt rewarding. I cannot say that my family is gonna love that I did this, but this is something that I did for me and I love how it turned out. Creeping up from the heathens got will, got fight, got pride, got reason. If they wanna go, we I did my makeup for the first time in a very long time and I just felt gorgeous. But that was short-lived because as an influencer I had to be on the go. I had places to be and packages to collect. So I threw on a hat for fear of judgment of what people would say and I left. I did not even get to bask in the moment of cutting my hair for too long because I had to come on the road to pick up a package and I uh, undid my little slip back because it was honestly um, itching me so I had to undo it now I'm picking up a package you guys do not want to see my hair under this it is absolutely embarrassing good evening And this hat is blowing and if the breeze ever take this off on the head, I probably might be. Oh my god. But yeah. I'll be home in a sec. I'm just picking up my package and going home. Whew. So I'll unbox this when we get home. It's only one package today. This is basically what I got. Um try to unbox it with y'all. So these are I forgot the, the, the name. It is Jigger bits or the J word. Wait, we're supposed to put fun crocs. 
these are actually foam runners i'm gonna open them up so you guys can see so there they go they actually come with the option for you to put these on but i'm i don't think i am gonna put them on if you're if you were watching my last vlog where I did the sheen unboxing, then this is the shoes that I wanted to go with the white top. This is the shoes I wanted to go with the white top and the whole um, chain pants outfit. So I have it now. It looks a bit big, but I plan, plan to wear it with socks. So it probably it's probably going to fit. But I can't wait to take these outfit pictures. I'm actually going to try them on right now. Yeah. So I tried on my shoes and I felt like the baddest bee. I absolutely love them they were so comfy and I felt like you know what let me just go back outside and try to get in as much more of the day that I can so I did just that and to be honest it was an honestly it was honestly a beautiful day and I just went for some retail therapy I honestly didn't plan to spend anything or buy anything but just to enjoy being outside so i was just hopping from store to store from supermarkets to beauty supply stores just taking life in and i honestly did cave in i did end up buying a few stuff um but yeah retail therapy is just one of my favorite ways to clear my head Eventually, I made my way to Popeyes because you guys saw I didn't have a substantial meal all day. So I went in and I ordered a bunch of food. I still did not end up eating everything, but at least I got something. And just like that, the day was finished and I was heading back home. To be honest, no two days look the same for me. They all have their unique ups and downs. One day, I am a busy YouTuber slash influencer. Another day, I'm just at home lounging and trying to figure out life just like anybody else. And that's why I started this series on my channel. So. I can share with you guys the good, the bad, and the indifferent about the everyday stuff that I go through. I hope you guys enjoy these videos and I will see you guys in another one.